Door County teenager missing for days has been found. Police reporting 17 year old Louis Amalichek was discovered in Chicago and taken to the hospital to get it checked out. Police said earlier in the week that he had left Sturgeon Bay with too many men online. We have no word yet on how the men, uh, how police believe the teen disappeared uh, or where the whereabouts of those two other men are. A Milwaukee family learning the fate of a man who killed their daughter more than 30 years ago. This story just heartbreaking. Pete Cervakis went to the Milwaukee County Courthouse today. He joins us live with the latest. Pete, you've been there all day. What's going on? Well, at least in Vince today, a judge told Jose Ferreira within the last hour that he's going to spend a max of seven years in prison. He will have the opportunity to get out early. He also gets credit for more than 500 days already served here at the Milwaukee County Jail. Now, according to prosecutors, back in 2015, Ferreira confessed to meeting Carrie Ann Jopek at a house party near 10th and Burnham in 1982. He says she fell down a flight of stairs after he shoved her in response to Jopek rejecting a sexual advance. Upon realizing she'd been killed, as Ferreira's story goes, he buried her body under the porch where it was found almost a year and a half later. Today in court, Joe Peck's family members said Ferreira, who lived just down the street, betrayed their family's trust. So I would like for him to be able to sit all the time that she had to sit under that porch. I can't take back how it happened. Sorry. Now, Ferreira was originally charged with second degree murder, but ultimately pleaded guilty to second degree sexual assault and false imprisonment. Jopek's family backed that deal since prosecutors told them it would be very difficult to get a murder conviction given how old this case was. However, they told us today they are still not sure that his version of events is the full truth regarding what happened. Live outside the Milwaukee County Courthouse, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4.